Hi, I'm Liv Coffey. I'm from Watkins Glen, New York, and I was in the 2018 Women's 8 that won gold this summer. I started rowing competitively in 2004 at Phillips Academy, and then I went on and I rowed at Harvard. Prior to college, I thought I was going to be like a superstar hockey player because that was my sport in high school. So that's actually the sport that drew me towards the Olympics. But then in college, I had a really great coach, Liz O'Leary, um, and she really developed my passion for the sport. And then I thought, this is something I would like to do. And so during the summers, I would come to the U23 team and compete internationally. And from there, I thought, well, maybe I can go for the Olympics. In Rio, I was a spare. And then I took a break after 2016, tried to figure out what I wanted to do. I worked for a year, decided I needed to continue my education, so I went to Cambridge um, and had the opportunity to compete in the boat race, which is kind of one of those unique rowing experiences that never, not everybody has the opportunity to do, so I was like, yes, let's go for this. And while I was there, I started to get back into good shape. I learned a lot from the coaches, but also my teammates, um, and I just thought, wow, I'm like really developing. I think I'm still getting better, so I should see this through to 2020. The really special things for me this year were winning the races and competing on successful teams and being a part of that. But since I got in the boat, I knew everybody was good. We had good practices. I never doubted that we could win, but there's a difference between thinking you could win and actually winning. And when it came to the final, it was just kind of executing what we knew we could do and what we were capable of on that day. And I rode with these women, many of them for feels like years and years and years. And I know they're very good racers, so just to get on the line and have a good race is a really satisfying way to end that season and bring us back to where we think we should be. I think knowing that 2020 will be the end of my competitive international rowing career is kind of um, bringing in the focus a, a bit for the next year and a half. A big part of it is just enjoying that I get to focus on athletics for this part of my life and after this point that won't really be the case anymore so just kind of enjoy training, enjoy the people I'm around, enjoy racing fast. That's my goal. No, I also got engaged. So, seven years, I did it. <laughs> so I'm excited for that.